in is John Cracciola, and he's with JVC Broadcasting. Hello, fine sir. How are you? Thank you for having me, Donna. <laughs> Always a pleasure to be here. Now, we're going to talk today about the radio stations that you run. Yes. Uh, where do we start? Well, we have uh, four radio stations serving Long Island in Suffolk County. We have uh, WRCN, which is our, our classic rock heritage station. Everybody loves WRCN. We have Party 105, which is our dance top 40 station featuring Vic Latino and Goomba Johnny. And we have um, My Country, our newest uh, radio station. We launched last year uh, the first uh, country station in the tri-state area, My Country 96.1. And we have La Fiesta, Long Island's only Hispanic FM radio station in Suffolk County. And um, we are Long Island's largest radio broadcast company, and we're the only independently owned radio broadcast company. We're not owned by a big conglomerate like um, Clear Channel or CBS or Viacom. We're owned by... Da, 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 you know? <laughs> the people that are still like plugging in the wires. The guy I mean, that's, that's still, really how you started, I did. isn't I started it, John? Let's talk about that. So, let's start talking yeah, about your that. early radio days. Fine. I got okay. hooked to radio. I thought I was going to be a baseball star. Okay. Then when I got out of uh, little league baseball and realized I couldn't hit a fastball, I had to, you know, do a career change. So I wanted to be a sports broadcaster. Um, and I got hooked at the college radio station, and the only position they had available was chief engineer. So I changed my major from communications to electrical engineering, and uh, it worked out pretty well. I was, the, you know, the engineer was always the guy at the radio station that you couldn't get rid of because he knew where the black and the red wires went. So you really can't. He's a valuable employee. And mislabeled so. them just in case somebody yeah, in job security. Had, yeah, he always <laughs> had your slow blow fuse in there just in case. <laughs> just in case. But um, I got hooked. The radio bug bit me at an early age, and you know, from there, out of college, to the world famous WLIR, which was which, which, which a heritage radio station. So proud to work there during its heyday with, you know, guys like Larry the Duck and Donna Donna and 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 Dennis McNamara, and um, from there to uh, Spanish Broadcasting Systems in California, which was a which was a fun time for a young guy, single, and um, <laughs> and and you know, always stayed in radio and and really had the opportunity. Uh, to purchase my own stations in, in 2008 and uh, made that leap and, you know, that scary leap and, and, and doing it on my own, you know, with some partners and some great people around me. You know, I, I'm, I'm so blessed to have such a great staff of Long Islanders that love radio just as I do. And it's, you know, we, we consider it a privilege and, and, and are proud to serve, you know, the island with four great radio stations. Now, why was one not enough for you? Like why? Like do not never enough. Never enough. Um, <laughs> it, it, you know, there really yeah. is some. It, it, it's nice to be able to walk into uh, an advertiser or a sponsor and give them multiple marketing solutions. Okay. To where I could say, you know, I'm going to help you, you know, uh, get a, get a, an older male demo. I'm going to help you reach the Hispanic demo. I'm going to help you reach the young kids. So it's really about a marketing solution for for advertisers and sponsors, which is how we make our money, as you know, on this even on this show. I mean, it's 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 you know, having you're you're there to help somebody sell something else, and I have more solutions. Um, and, and they're affordable solutions. So that's why the, the economy, the, the bulk is, is good. And it's also important, I think, because um, Long Island is so diverse, uh, offering people choices in music. Oh, absolutely. I mean, you know, the different, different formats, and we're a niche format radio company with Spanish and country and dance top 40 and a, a classic rock with a library of 28,000 songs. I mean, these guys still play CDs, you know? <laughs> and and it's um, it, it, it's a very unique mix uh, of, of formats that, that really we could walk into any advertiser or sponsor and, and probably service their needs very affordable and, and, and very economical. And you do a lot for the community as well, and you also have a lot of community events. You're yeah. everywhere. I mean, I think that's so important. That's what we lost in radio in the last couple of years when big conglomerates took over. It really lost the localism and the ability to walk into the Brookhaven Animal Shelter and say, okay, we're going to help you get these dogs and cats adopted or we'll walk into big brothers and big sisters and, and help them get their message out. You know, radio, going back to the early days, was, a community's, was the community's voice, the community's megaphone, and we lost that. And I'm really trying hard to bring that back. That's what, you know, makes us very unique and special. We're, look, we're Long, the company is run by Long Islanders. We're all Long Islanders. We live here, too. And, and you know, if we can make this place just a little better, you know, we're going to try. Well, it sounds like a lot of fun. I know, I know you work really hard, but I know that you love what you do, and it shows your passion comes I, through every I love day. It. I have no friends anymore, but I love it. 
<laughs> I wouldn't say that's, I don't, I don't think that's yeah. true. <laughs> well, if uh, somebody wanted to learn more about your stations, where would you send them first? JVCBroadcasting.com, and you can get to any radio station from there. You can get to our event company, and you can find out all about us. Fabulous. And I know Live It Up is going to be um, doing some things with you as well. So. Live It Up is, we're very proud to have a partnership with Live It Up and, and, and have you guys uh, have your, um, your shows home on our website. Fabulous. Thank you so much. And uh, if you didn't see John last time he was on our show, um, I just wanted to credit him because because of John, I had my first talk show and it was on LIR. So thanks so much for watching. Stay tuned for more on Live It Up.